Are you ready to make a move on Google stock? Get ready for an in-depth analysis of Google. Our initial report was just the beginning, and now we're taking it to the next level. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell to stay on top of our latest insights. Stay ahead of the game and don't miss out on any game-changing updates that could impact your investments. Take your trading decisions to the next level with our groundbreaking AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Unleash the power of AI and get accurate price predictions and comprehensive analysis for over 25,000 companies worldwide today. Keep in mind that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Hey there! Want to know about Google's stock performance? Well, our system has some interesting insights for you. According to our analysis from September 21, 2023, Google has been ranked as a sell candidate with a score of minus 3.63. Now, let's dive into the numbers and see how the stock has been performing during this period. Brace yourself. Hold on tight, because the stock experienced a loss of minus 0.15%. Ouch! Can you believe it? On average, that's a daily loss of minus 0.07% since it was listed as a sell candidate. Not looking good. Get ready for some exciting news. Our current three-month trend points towards a promising 15.88% potential change in the next three months. That means you could enjoy a return between 15.88% and 24.04%. But wait, there's more. Brace yourself for the thrilling 12-month trend. It suggests a whopping 50.51% change over the next year. Picture this, a potential return between 33.82% and 60.57%. Now that's something to get excited about. And here's the best part, after a year, the price range could soar from $174.31 to $209.14. Can you imagine the possibilities? Welcome back to our daily update on Google. Today's headline reads, Red Day on Friday for Google Stock after a 0.146% loss. Let's dive into the details. On the last trading day, Friday, September 22, 2023, Google Stock experienced a slight decline of minus 0.146%, with prices dropping from $130.44 to $130.25. This marks the fourth consecutive day of decline. Throughout the day, the stock's value fluctuated by 1.87%, ranging from a low of $129.61 to a high of $132.03. Over the past 10 days, the stock has fallen in six instances, resulting in an overall decrease of minus 4.49%. Interestingly, the trading volume also decreased along with the stock, which can be seen as a positive sign, as volume usually follows the stock's movement. Specifically, the trading volume decreased by 9 million shares on the last day, with a total of 23 million shares bought and sold, amounting to approximately $2.97 billion. Let's take a broader look at Google's stock performance. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest recorded price was $139.16, while the lowest was $83.34. Currently, the stock price is 6.4%, or $8.91, below its 52-week high, and a significant 94.68%, or $2,318.67, below its all-time high on June 14, 2021, when it reached $2,448.92. Exciting Analyst Ratings for Google Breaking News Let's talk about some recent analyst ratings for Alphabet Incorporated, the parent company of Google. On Wednesday, August 30, 2023, Citigroup gave Google a buy grade with a hold action. This is a strong indication of their confidence in the stock. And that's not all. On the same day, KeyBank also gave Google an overweight grade with a hold action. This is another positive sign for the stock's performance. But wait, there's more. On Wednesday, July 26, 2023, Needham gave Google an overweight grade with a hold action. This shows that multiple analysts are bullish on the stock. In fact, on the same day, Needham once again gave Google a buy grade with a hold action. This reaffirms the positive sentiment surrounding the stock.
Lastly, on Wednesday, July 26, 2023, KeyBank gave Google an overweight grade with a hold action. This further adds to the bullish outlook for the stock. Welcome back, folks. Today we're diving into the thrilling world of Google stock and what the analysts have to say about it. Brace yourselves, because the analysts have given Google stock a resounding by rating. Hold on to your seats, because they rate the P.E. ratio as a screaming strong buy and the price to book ratio as an emphatic strong buy. It's like the analysts are shouting it from the rooftops. But wait, there's more. When it comes to return on investment, the analysts give the stock an intriguing neutral rating. It's not a clear-cut decision, but it certainly adds a layer of mystery to the equation. So, there you have it, folks. The analysts are buzzing with excitement about Google stock, with a buy rating, and enthusiastic endorsements for the P.E. ratio and price-to-book ratio. However, the return on investment rating adds a dash of suspense to the mix. It's certainly an intriguing situation to keep an eye on. Welcome to our analysis of Google's stock signals. Currently, the technical signals for Google are leaning towards the negative side. Both short and long-term moving averages suggest a sell position, painting a cautious outlook for the stock. However, there is potential for a positive turn if the stock manages to break above the resistance levels at $135.17 and $132.77, triggering by signals. On Monday, September 18, 2023, a sell signal was issued from a pivot top point, resulting in a decline of minus 5.76% so far. This indicates a potential further fall until a new bottom pivot is established. Additionally, the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, is currently signaling a sell. However, it's worth noting that the volume decreased in conjunction with the price during the last trading day, which reduces the overall risk as volume tends to follow price movements. Welcome, fellow investors. Let's dive into some exciting signals that you won't want to miss. First up, we have the moving average convergence divergence, giving us a compelling sell signal. Next, the pivots are indicating a sell signal that occurred 5 days ago. On the Bollinger front, we received a buy signal a promising 15 days ago. Keep an eye on the short-term moving average, as it gave us a sell signal just 4 days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average also signaled a sell just 3 days ago. Now, let's explore the intriguing relationship between the short and long moving averages. We observed a buy signal a whopping 48 days ago. Shifting our focus to the 12-month chart, here's what we discovered. The short moving average indicated a sell signal four days ago. Meanwhile, the long-term moving average surprised us with a buy signal a remarkable 134 days ago. And once again, we witness a positive relationship between the short and long moving averages, with a buy signal 129 days ago. Exciting stuff, right? Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us for more intriguing signals. Are you ready to explore the world of Google support, risk, and stop loss? Let's dive in. Picture this, Google finds support from accumulated volume at an intriguing price point of $129.78. It's like a hidden gem, just waiting for you to discover it. And guess what? This level may hold a buying opportunity, creating an exciting chance for an upwards reaction when the support is tested. Now, let's talk about risk. Brace yourself because it's about to get interesting. With Google being a stock that usually trades at a good volume, the risk is considered to be low. That means you can breathe a little easier knowing that the odds are in your favor. But wait, there's more. Let's take a closer look at the stock's recent performance. In just the last day, it moved an impressive $2.42, 1.87%, between its highest and lowest points. Talk about a roller coaster ride. And over the past week, the stock has shown an average daily volatility of 2%. This tells us that there's never a dull moment when it comes to Google stock. Get ready for an exciting dive into the world of trading with Google. But first, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data that will set the stage for our analysis. Picture this, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures where Google's current share price stands in relation to its per-share earnings. 
It's like a key that unlocks hidden insights. Now, here's the interesting part. A relatively low P-E ratio could be a secret signal, indicating a low expectation for the future of the company or even that the stock is undervalued. Can you smell the potential buying opportunity in the air? But wait, there's more. Brace yourself for the upcoming earnings report for Q3 2023, expected to make waves on October 23, 2023. It's going to be a defining moment. Keep your eyes peeled for the analysts' consensus estimates, currently set at $1.45. These numbers have the power to move mountains in the stock market. Are you ready for the roller coaster ride? Welcome, traders. Today, let's dive into the exciting world of day trading and explore some potential levels for Google. Picture this, an upward trend in Google's stock. The first resistance level we need to keep an eye on is at $132.58. If you're not yet a shareholder, it may be wise to wait for this level to be breached before jumping in. But for those who are already in the game, this level could present a golden opportunity for swing trading. Now, let's consider the downside. Google encounters its first support level at $129.78. Imagine this, if this support holds, it could be the perfect entry point for you, as it may signal a rebound in the stock's price. Exciting, isn't it? Are you ready to discover the insider trading activity happening at Google? Stay tuned as we dive into the recent trades and calculate the insider power. Let's begin with some intriguing insider trades. On August 3, 2023, John L. Hennessy, a prominent insider, made a significant buy of 2,444 shares of Class C capital stock. Fast forward to September 11, 2023, when John L. Hennessy surprised us with two insider sells. First, he sold 54 shares of Class C capital stock, followed by another sell-off of 146 shares. But that's not all. On the same day, John L. Hennessy made yet another sell, this time disposing of 2,444 shares of Class C capital stock. Now, let's shift our focus to another insider, John Kent Walker. On September 6, 2023, he caught our attention with a substantial buy of 42,900 shares of Class C capital stock. After analyzing the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative, with a ratio of minus 91.170. This indicates a higher selling trend among insiders. Overall, insiders have purchased a total of 300,909 shares and sold a staggering 7,506,876 shares in the last 100 trades. Hold on tight. We've got some bad news about this stock and there's no stop loss in place. Are you wondering if Google stock is a good buy? Let's dive into the analysis and uncover the potential signals for Google stock performance. While there are a few negative signals, we'll explore the positive trend and determine if it can outweigh the weaknesses. Our findings suggest that Google may perform weekly in the upcoming days or weeks, but there's an interesting twist. After analyzing the volatility and movements of the last trading day, our systems have discovered an undervalued current price. Now, let's take a closer look at what we can expect for Google's trading on Monday, September 25th. We anticipate an opening increase of $0.377 and a starting trading price of $130.63. Are you ready to take on the world of trading? But hold on. It's important to know that trading involves a high risk of losing money. Don't worry, we've got your back. Before you make any moves, make sure to consult a financial advisor. They'll guide you through the ups and downs of the market. Now, let's talk about stockinvest.us. While we provide valuable information, it's crucial not to solely rely on us for your investment decisions. Remember, the final call is yours to make. We believe in empowering you, but with great power comes great responsibility. You are liable for the choices you make. Welcome to Stock Invest, where we dive into the exciting world of stocks. Take a look at our current view on this stock. We want to hear your thoughts. Share your agreement or disagreement in the comments below. And hey, what's your target for this stock? 
We're all ears. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more exciting stock content. Wishing you all successful trading and a truly beautiful day, from everyone here at Stock Invest.